this is Lana's Enchanted Sky, your spiritual fairy godmother, bringing you your reading for Aquarius 2024 for March. Please hit like and subscribe to for a chance to win a free reading hypnosis wherever I do. I got tons of sales. Check out www.enchantedsky.com. Um, also, my blogs are on there, Metaphysical Meanderings. There are some podcasts on there. Check it all out. Check it all out. Um, so joke of the day. What does it mean when you find a horseshoe in Ireland? A horse lost its shoe. <laughs> there you go. That's your joke. Happy St. Patrick's Day. <laughs> Didn't know I was Irish. Found out that I, most of my family says they were born in Ireland. I find that very interesting because they told me I had no Irish in me at all. But when I looked on the, they got to be Irish. They're born in Ireland. Like, so anyway. All right. So. Um, it looks like they're wondering, you know, making some plans. Now, Aquarius should have a lot of luck this year because Pluto came into Aquarius and it's going to sit there for a long time. Um, you are transforming your life. There's a transformation card there. You're going to be making a few decisions this month and you be careful about your decisions. Think things through. Yeah, there's an offer coming. There's also a, a meeting with somebody. So this could be a boss. It could be love. All right. Um, I'm going to show you in a minute, but it's all about, the, now this is about making plans or even dealing with the internet. And there's a way, there's a wave of success coming. And here's setting boundaries and making great strides. And here's the transformation card coming in the near future throughout the month. You'll know in 30 days what I'm talking about. All right. Now here, this is the energy around you. It's in the box thinking or it's religious thinking. And there's been some discontent that's been going on for the whole the whole time or daydreaming or just trying to get away. Like maybe you're not so happy with thinking in the box. I, I've been pulling this card a lot this year um, so far in the last couple months for everybody because that's what's going to be your success is not thinking like you have been. Okay. Now, this is an offer. There is an offer. And like I said, This can be an offer. Now, this can be, this person respects you and you respect them. Can it be love? Oh, it could be. For some of you, yes, it could be. But it's either way, it's it's mutual respect, okay? And there's going to be some mock battles, petty annoyances, and crap you're going to have to get through. Now, there's a king of cups appearing. Wise counsel. It can be a... Uh, Pisces, a uh, Cancer, or a Scorpio, but it also can be just wise counsel or a time of healing for you, all right? Because they're telling you to be strong and wise, and this is the card of healing, usually health and healing, okay? And so it's going to lead to a happy family and a happily ever after. Here are the cards. Here's 30 days. You see the transformation card? Happily ever after. That's destiny. That's destiny. It has to do with being strong and wise. Strong and wise, card of Leo. There might even be a Leo person involved. Here's you being successful. Here's you working hard. Here's a lot of crap you got to get through. Here's that meeting. Come on now, you guys, you can do this. You know, it's, this is the destiny. This is the what's going to be happening. There's a transformation. It could even be a spiritual awakening, okay? Change physicians. If you need a second opinion, get one. Give us your, your cares. That means friends, family, it's good for you. You know, they, they people do care. You know, you don't have to constantly unload on everybody, but on occasion, yeah. Have faith. It's all going to work out. It's going to work out well. Uh, get some help if you need it. Don't be afraid. Don't be too prideful. And children, hang out with kids. They, they, they keep you youthful. They really do. Blessings to you. Make it a great month. And how can you make the planet a better place?